Now that we've explored command lines that, the, that display things, let's start filtering that display. We're going to be able to filter with three simple command lines, two of which are very similar. We'll start with those two. Head, display first lines of a file. And tail, display the last part of a file. So if I do head on our example file, it will display that file's first 10 lines. And if I do tail on an example file, it will display that file's last 10 lines. Easy peasy. Those two command lines are very similar, which means their options are as well. In tails man, we can see that we can add a dash n option, which allows you to pick the amount of lines you want displayed. If I want the last three lines, all I have to do is tail dash n three my file dot text. So yeah, those two command lines are pretty basic. Now let's check out grep, today's third command line. With grep, you'll be able to specify which lines you want to display. For example, if we do a grep of Mateo on my file dot text, it'll display all lines that contain the keyword Mateo. Grep has a lot of options. Let's explore a couple. Grep minus V my tail file.txt selects lines of, that are not matching my tail. Grep minus I my tail file.txt performs case insensitive matching with my tail. Again, there are many options for greps. Some of them are very useful. Check out its man and you'll see. Grep is a command line you'll use a lot. You should also check out how people use it on the internet. With those three command lines, you should be able to filter your files.